Mate, I am in my everyday outpost. I like this. Uh, this plant has a safe water. Uh, it has a breathable atmosphere. I'm gonna show my top tier. So I'm gonna start with the chip, but uh, just to let you know, I am a level 143. Uh, this is my main character. Um, I have many other characters. And between them, I have played very close to 1,000 hours of gameplay. So, of course, in my main character is where I have the top gear. Uh, I'm gonna start with the chip. This is the Renegade tree which you can the tree you can get when you hit uh, uh, level 72 and um, I, I love the name, and the shape is not the best shape, uh, but this, even it doesn't look aerodynamic, it has a mobility almost at 100%, where all the upgrades I'm going to talk about. So, you can get this is a, a bit elusive chip to get. Uh, what you could do, uh, you can buy in any major chip yard, but what you could do is build uh, this uh, uh, let me show you the a lamp pad with chip builder you go just outside your outpost and, and put another outpost only with this and build as many times until you get here the way to buy it anyway you still need to upgrade it uh, i'm gonna show what i have uh, i have the best everything so this is the best weapon in the game for the chip even have been nerfed when uh, initially this have a fire rate of four and it was way overpowered i even uh, put a video saying it was a joke for the game i seen somebody saw it because they nerfed it and now has a fire rate of 1.5 but still it's very good and you can combine with the Vanguard. Uh, I have Vanguard here. Uh, I have uh, uh, three and three. So this is my primary weapon, and this is the second weapon. And then um, this is the best engine. Uh, the Poseidon DT-203. As you see, it has mobility almost 196. Um, you put this uh, extra engine just to complement the power. This is the best reactor you can get at 40 and with uh, Basco you can get 41. Um, the best chill is this one. The SG 1800 chill generator. Um, it doesn't give you initially, originally, as much luxury, but I put everything out that you can actually build stuff inside your chip. This is very comfortable, as I'm gonna show you. For my crew of seven, 
this has a crew of seven. You see my uh, crew of seven. And I'm gonna show you, I have uh, this crew, and you're gonna see it because I'm gonna show some of the, uh, This is the crew I have. I am a starboard, so I have all four original uh, constellation. Uh, you can have all four if you are starboard. And, uh, plus Vasco and Rossi and Omari Hassan. So that's my crew. So I have uh, seven beds because even Vasco doesn't sleep. I have Cora. So this is the, the, the inside. I have all the commodities. Hey, how are you? That's Cory. The first thing you get uh, is this. Uh, the infirmary. Um, here you have uh, two uh, two beds and a, 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 a toilet. And here doesn't have a, a workshop. Uh, habitat but I put because now you can build stuff in your uh, in the next, uh, last update you can build stuff in your ship I put this uh, here this weapon workbench this is a captain uh, quarters these have five comfortable bed plus two I built and here this is a spacesuit workbench and the infirmary, which uh, have infirmary habit, has the, the science. And I have this self serving monte clearance as well, uh, which I built. Um, Your ship is way bigger than Dad's. Uh, this is the infirmary uh, habitat. And here there is a two, two more beds. And just what is on your mind at this moment? Ah, in one place I built two more beds. I like this ship because I have a huge cargo as well. I'll show you. You see, well, I have the payload uh, perk, so I can have a lot of stuff in here. So, we have uh, this command center over here, which is awesome, and I built close by here I put two more beds I make a layer room so you have seven beds in total five very comfortable at this bunk probably here is where Cora sleep um, have this command center here and of course the cockpit let me go, it's on top. Yes, go to the cockpit. That's another console there. And this is the cockpit. So this is a very comfortable, cheap and terrific weapon. I am getting ready for the Shatter space, and this is gonna be my chip. I actually I am 
chasing the legendary maroon chip. Well, it's a loss if I have been jumping around systems, try to find the voices. Uh, he moves. He, he knows that uh, it's not much for this chip. Well, maybe it is. Only fighting will know. But uh, if you know where to find the let me know because I wanted to make a video of the fight between this chip oh I'm sorry I'm talking is a ecliptic the ecliptic one is the most powerful legend I already faced the uh, the spacer one I think there are three I already faced one Sometimes I just want to turn off the grab drive so I can float around. Um, I want to look for the Maroon, uh, the uh, click the one, which is the, it's the most powerful because it's the one who has hold and chills. I'm trying to look for Sanko because he has a, a tracker alliance, a superior tracker alliance. Uh, a superior track alliance a space suit which is the most is the best suit in the game even his is legendary I, fa I found that uh, now you do this is a new suit and doing the missions you can find that uh, uh, non-legendary and legendary. You can buy the non-legendary in places. Where is Sanko? Um, well, maybe it's here. Shoot. I was hoping you would stop by. There is. So let me it's just. A strange feeling. No, happy to even out the load. So let me show the best. So this is with not. This is a legendary. This is superior. Oh, actually, this is advanced. I saw I have the superior. But the best is the superior. So this is not the best stand. The superior, I guess, is more. This is not modded, but at least it's legendary. Um. Where is? Oh, here is. He has a superior helmet. You see, huge stats. So this is the best space suit in the game, and I have it for him. I mean, if you mod it, this stuff is way, way over. Uh, so this is the best space suit you can find. I particular not using that one. You take care, all right? Hey, I am use. How's your day? Uh, because I love the UC and I, I love the and this my spacesuit is fully modded. Also, I have a, a very good physical. So between fully modded and my and my physical is is I am happy with it also if you didn't know this suit depending on your level at uh, uh, this level over 100 if you go back to Londinium every two days you can find another uh, they, they respond uh, every day but if you are lower level I have another character I just started I wanted to do that and, and it goes up to four four days real days but it responds so you can give it to your uh, to your uh, like I give it to for instance to bar credit for your thoughts as they say oh I think uh, let me see yes. I, I, I gave it to uh, Check my all ears. Looking for something? 
So you see, I have buried the Anticino space. Um, that's right. the best. Later. Do you need my help? And I have a for Andrea. I'm glad to see you. If I can take a few things, I will. She, I well, I gave this uh, which I got uh, beaten uh, at the end. The two big uh, starboard, the hunter, and the other one. This come from the other one. Do remember his name? You need to to beat both. Well, uh, I, I gave this to. Uh, and I gave uh, my uh, to uh, uh, Andrea half my uh, starboard, which is uh, the the biggest starboard. Where is the Venator? This is the the biggest starboard suit you can get. Well, besides the one it just came with. But this is playing the starboard game. When you get to the maximum level, you can get. Take care of yourself. Um, Asara, I, I gave it the new one. The mystery, the mystery one, which you can get the in the creations the the gravy suit i gave that to sarah okay so let's go to the what's going on weapons top gear weapons these are the ones i use you know for the rifle this rifle It's the best rifle in the game, in my view. Well, it's set apart. I mean, you have the Max Sniper, which oh, has a slightly better damage, but this, you can put a suppressor on it. Also, the accuracy is way better with that range. You made this rifle excellent. Uh, I know it has, some people say, uh, uh, like I saw a prominent YouTuber saying that uh, it doesn't reload. I have it in this character, in a very low level character, in both, no problem Gorgeous with reloading. Day, isn't it? I love this place. Uh, the only bad rap it comes from this creation, which is a pay one. Like this suit is free, which is great, but this is, is a pay one. Um, the other thing is, it's a rifle you only get at that level, like this is not the same rifle I got here, like I got, this is an advanced one, and I didn't got the advanced in my low level character, and it got stuck there, and there is no in the wall, I mean, yeah, in the wall, but there are no legendaries, so like the Max Sniper can be legendary. Still, even though, with that accuracy, uh, and, and, and then you can put this, the stealth, uh, because I have the suppressor, you have the stealth perks applied to it. I mean, this is a one shot most of the time. So, this is uh, ever popular, the revenue. You, you get to uh, doing the Crimson Fleet Westlife. Either you are lying with them or you are fighting them. You get it both ways. So it doesn't matter where you go. And this is the best chat gone you can get if you can get the instigating one or extend the magazine it will be even better as a, and this because actually i used to have a, 
uh, mud pools, a very good, very good. But because I have this ammunition, I decided to switch to the big bang. So now this is my, uh, and this is the, the melee weapon I am using. Uh, it has a very fast, this is, has a very fast, because it has a light white hand. It reduces a bit the damage, but it goes very fast. So this is, so this is my top gear, guys. Uh, can hardly wait for my chattered uh, space yes, to, to, to face the room with this chip. Hey, Captain. Need um, help with anything? And this. Yes, you need something? A gear. So the, the need gear I, Captain? I give. I'll take good no, care of your things. I normally give them uh, negotiators. Like, this is a very good one. I found it. We'll catch up later. Like, Sarah has a very good one. Talk to me. So you can tell me, guy, if this is not... This ship is not cozy and extremely powerful. Again, you can give me. Uh, I still need to face the Baru one, which is supposed to be the weakest one, the legendary, according to what I've read in, on the internet, and the eclectic one, which is supposed to be, because it's the one who has chills and hold huge chill and whole start. You can give me that tip. If a way to find it. That it doesn't involve using console commands. Let me know. Um, a brief history of time. Uh, oh, it's nice to finally be off our ship. Good day, Captain. I'm gonna just go... I love this game. Let me know if you have any question about Top Gear or if you think you have a better Top Gear, just place it on the comment. I will be happy to read it. Until next time.